AE92 type Toyota Corolla GTS, Sprinter Truenum, found in a scrapped car park place. In the United States, there are many Toyota cars given the name Corolla though it is a model unrelated to or related to Corolla. For example, in the early 1980s, people with limited budget purchased a new car Corolla Tercel, which was a model with nothing to do with ordinary Corolla. Then, in the same dealer as the legendary rear-wheel drive AE86 Corolla, front-wheel drive A82 Corolla, Japan name, Corolla FX, was also sold at the same time. In 1987, the Corolla also adopted a front-wheel driven A90 type platform, which was sold jointly with these until 1988, but its hot version GT. S is sold in the Japanese market as Sprinter True and no it was sold as a model. Was it confusing? People who recently placed a Honda's V6 engine on a GTS roof found in a self-service type scrapped car park in Northern California must have been confused as well. Also on the trunk is a transmission made by Old Detroit. According to the standards of 1988, this Corolla GTS was a fairly fast car. This is especially true given the conservative price of $10,408, if you convert it by adjusting the inflation rate, now it is $21,000 and the Japanese yen is about 2.36 million yen. At that time, while purchasing BMW 325 with the maximum output of 127 horsepower on a new car had to pay $23,750, the AE92 Corolla GTS had a maximum output of 115 horsepower and the weight of the car was as light as 272 kilograms. In the scrapped car discovered this time, many parts were stripped from inside the car, but the 4GE type engine was left. Even now, this engine is not difficult to find, so those who took away other parts also ended up leaving after all. Because it is a front-wheel drive, the AE92 type Corolla has survived longer than the rear-wheel driven A86 and the former T72. The rear-wheel drive Corolla has been destroyed by all young people who are willing to drift middle got king that's it. However, contrary to now, unlike the Cherokee which gather support from Mania, Few people think that they want to revive with the Corona's Corolla with a lot of time and expenses. The Corolla of the 1980s cannot live forever, 